Welcome to our amazing presentation all about Tutankhamun's tomb and Howard Carter's destiny to a life of wealth. Howard Carter, the archaeologist, knew there was one more tomb to be found. Even though it took him six whole years to discover the tomb, he still acted as he found it the second he started to look. Howard Carter sent a telegram to Lord Carnarvon demanding him to come over to help him open the tomb. The person who actually found it was a little water boy that was the slave of Howard Carter, so Howard Carter got all the glory from it. Finally came the day when Howard Carter and Lord Carnarvon searched inside the tomb even though the government of Cairo told them otherwise. In the tomb of Tutankhamun, the statues were the first thing they saw. Howard Carter thought that it was a mark for a secret door. He was right. Behind the false wall was the treasure of Tutankhamun and of course the sarcophagus was laying there as well. Inside the ancient coffin was the golden suit that the young pharaoh lived in. Many of the treasures were symbols of the gods and survived in one piece until the tomb was opened. Howard Carter is by far the most favourite archaeologist known in history and will stay that way for a long time. Unfortunately, Lord Carnarvon died from a mosquito bite and never got fame from it. Thanks for listening.